Okay, so this video is going to be about on how you can make a simple electric generator with a DC motor. To do this, you're going to need a voltmeter, DC electric motors, and a power source, which is just going to be my hand. If you don't know the difference between DC and AC current, or how electric motors work, then just subscribe because I have those videos coming. To start, you're going to take the wires coming off of the battery or the motor and connect them to the electrodes of the voltmeter. So what I've got here, you can see I've got the positive electrode just connected by a paper clip to the wire that goes to the positive side of the battery. So now I've done this with the negative side as well. And now it's time to set the voltmeter. The voltmeter is blank right now. I'm going to set it to that setting. You can see it says zero. So now I've got the voltmeter hooked up and turned on. And now I'm just going to take this gear on the side because it was from a small tire compressor pump. And I'm just going to spin it like this. You can see vo small volt fluctuations and that's because I can't get it up to a significant speed just spinning it. But if you had it hooked up to say an engine spinning at very high RPM then it would make an alternator. That's what the alternator on your car is. Or if you had hooked up to a wind turbine or a water turbine that was geared up, then you could generate electricity. So this is basically just the whole setup for the small electric motor generator. You need the motor, the voltmeter, and you can hook the ops both these sides of the motor up to say like a light bulb or and you can even hook this up to whatever you want that could generate it. This is just a small experiment. It's really simple. So this is my fourth video. If you liked it you should check out my channel, YouTube Engineer, and hit this button. My other videos are right here.